Thank you, Doctor. Oh, no, little kitty. Don't thank me. Thanks to my healthy set of shiny teeth that enabled me to crush the hard layer of the invincible walnut like it's nothing. Oh, you're already here, my friends. I'm sure you witnessed the jaw-dropping strength of my teeth. So today, let us peek into our mouth and explore the chewy world of bony enameled coated structures in the jaws we call the teeth. Zoomid! So friends, as we all know, your teeth help you chew your food while eating, assist you while talking, and makes you look better when you flash a smile for those selfies. But there is a lot about this essential tool we call the teeth. You probably don't know. So first, let us know about the types, parts, the ins and outs of teeth. Although you are born with 20 baby teeth, they aren't visible until they start to come through the gums when you are about 6 to 12 months old. And by the time you are 2 to 3 years of age, all the teeth will usually appear. This process called teething and the new set of teeth are called the primary teeth, baby teeth or milk teeth. And as you get older, around 5 to 6 years of age, these primary teeth begin to fall one after the other. This happens because it is being pushed out of the way by the permanent tooth that is behind it and gradually replaces the primary teeth. By the time you are around 12 or 13, most of you have lost all your baby teeth and have a full set of permanent teeth. But it's not over yet. Between the age of 17 and 25, most of you will have four teeth called wisdom teeth that grow at the back of the mouth to complete the adult set of 32 shiny white teeth. These 32 set are divided into four different types. Let's start with the incisors. These are your eight front teeth with four on the top and four at the bottom. They help you to cut your food into small pieces, making it easier to swallow. Next comes the canine. These are the sharp pointy teeth next to your incisors. There are two on the bottom and two on the top. They help you tear food especially chewy foods like meat. Then comes premolars, also called bicuspids, located next to your canine teeth. They are somewhat flat with ridges on top. They are four on each side and helps you to crush and grind the food you eat as they are stronger than your incisors and canines. But not the strongest because that title goes to the molars located in the back of your mouth and there are four on both the top and the bottom. Finally comes the fifth type of tooth that is somewhat rare in most people is the third molar also known as wisdom tooth. Wisdom teeth sometimes can be removed because they can crowd and damage other teeth causing pain. <sighs> Trivia time! Did you know experts believe that wisdom teeth may have been needed by people millions of years ago who had larger jaws and ate food that required a lot of chewing like raw meat? Also, did you know that right-handed people chew food on the right side of their mouths and left-handed people chew food on the left side? If not, then do observe your friends and family's eating pattern. But do not go too close to their mouth or else it will be awkward for them. <laughs> it's question time! Today's question is, how many teeth are babies born with? Do write your answer in the comment section below and hit the like button to be a part of the Peekaboo family. 
and get a chance to get it featured by the end of our videos. So, here are the winners of the previous episode. Hope you enjoyed today's episode. And until next time, it's me, Dr. Binox, zooming out. Ah, never mind. Hey kids, you liked my videos, didn't you? Before you go, don't forget to click on the subscribe button and the bell. So you won't miss out on my latest videos. <laughs> See you.